Millennials, how do you feel about having children? I can barely support myself, much less a child. Back in the heydays of the baby boomers, people didn't think about stuff like that. They just fricked and squirted out babies. Children, I can't even afford an apartment. My old apartment painted the cabinets a darker brown then tried to increase the rent by an extra $400 because it's a luxury apartment. 23 and I feel so incredibly far from ready, can't imagine when I will be, since I don't really have any of my crap together. I am curious about what my own child would look like, but the thought of pregnancy is scary and I would just rather adopt a dog or maybe a small lizard, who knows. A lizard would be pretty freaking sick. I had a vasectomy, that's how I feel. I got a vasectomy and my wife has an IUD. We are doubling up on our baby prevention methods. I'm not particularly interested. 1. Because I don't think I'd be good at it no matter what. 2. I wouldn't be able to give my kids what my parents gave me. Babies are great though. Anyone who wants a break please hand your babies to me for a maximum of 3 hours, or until they poop. I grew up in a broken home. While my parents loved me, we were in constant financial ruin because they were two people who started a family accidentally and never learned how to actually be parents. And it tore us all apart. I used to do the grocery shopping for my parents. I wrote up their budget. They never followed it, but I was great at buying exactly the amount needed for groceries. I cleaned. I did the laundry. I raised my younger siblings. I have about a 12 year age gap with them, right up until I moved out when I was 20. It still doesn't mean much. I still suck at budgeting. I'm an awful cook, and because I have lived a life where I got no upper advantages, I never, ever want to make another life experience the crap I did. I can't imagine putting another life through a Canadian winter without heat like I did. I never want my child to look at me with tears in their eyes because I can't afford a field trip for them. I can never fathom my child having to settle for less because I can't send them to get a proper education. I don't ever want to tell my child they're a mistake and I don't love them because they ruined my life. I'm never having children. Sometimes I think it'd be fun to watch a little human grow and become their own person but then I remember the crap like school plays, parent teacher meetings and kids parties and I consider ripping my own ovaries out on the spot. Not to mention the horrific process of growing the dang thing and shoving it out. Honestly, I'm dreading it. I have three siblings, so my parents aren't particularly worried if I don't have kids since they have three other chances to have grandchildren. My husband, on the other hand, is an only child. His parents have been begging us to give them grandchildren since the day we got married. No joke, they want us to have at least three kids. Please only have kids if you actually want kids, otherwise it may not turn out so great. Source, my mother. I'd rather have dogs and money. I'm an early millennial, 1982. And honestly I think by the time I secure a stable job with real homeowner and retirement possibilities I'll be too old to have children. Same here, I'm born in 1986. Also on the older side of millennial, my parents were my age when they had me, and I'm nowhere near stable enough financially to consider bringing a dependent into the mix. On the plus side, my mother has come to understand the economic difficulties of my generation, and has stopped pressuring me to have kids. I've pretty much decided I don't want kids. Knowing a lot of people who've had them I've seen how much time, energy, money, sanity, social life and freedom they take up. They do gain a lot of memories in the cute moments. But it's not a trade off I see any value in. That does make it harder being single and trying to find someone rather difficult. As it's unfair to pursue a romantic relationship with someone who wants kids. There's always cats. I definitely do not want to give birth, ever. If I end up financially stable and with a supportive partner, I would like to be a foster parent and or adopt. Yes, we as a society need to start normalizing adoption fostering as valid parenting options, and not just the next best thing for couples who are infertile. I'm an 82 kid, I have no children and I feel that I never will have any. I personally don't feel ready to have them, let alone how the world is anymore. I'd rather have a stable life, a decent career and my dogs. 
Yes I know they're short lived but a dog's life is simple and happy. I will never have to explain to my child how a politician or a religious group or someone out on their own interests has now forever changed their life and mine. I'd rather just take my friend's kids out if I have that urge to be around them. At first I thought you were saying you were 82. As a person with 4 officially diagnosed neurological disorders, Tourette's, OCD, Addict and Asperger's, I refuse to pass on my genes. I don't want anyone going through what me or my family went through as I grew up. As someone with a crappy as frick skin disease, mental illness, Asperger's, life threatening allergies, scoliosis, spondylosis, a spine bone cyst, degenerative disc disease, and a husband who doesn't know half of his genetic background, nor does he want kids, a fricking men. Daycare for one kid will cost 47% of my take home pay, okay, it's 21% of my husband's and my take home pay, which is a more meaningful number, my work has no maternity leave policy for someone in my position so I hope I don't end up going without pay until the kid is old enough to send to daycare. I'm just stocking up on cool animals instead of having kids. No kids for me. No thanks. I just don't want them. I'm a godmother and an aunt. I'll just borrow a kid when baby fever hits and within a couple hours I'm done. I'm 28. In a stable marriage, stable job for both of us. And we just bought a house that theoretically could house at least two children but I don't see it happening. He isn't especially fond of how noisy and demanding children are, as well as the sass and destruction. I love spending time with my friends kids and I think I would enjoy having kids of my own. But I like sleep. I like travel. I like being able to do what I want when I want it. So I think that hubs and I, he's 85 and I'm 88, are just going to go no kids. Our parents will just have to frickin deal. Plan to adopt. I'd really like children someday when I'm married and have my life together. When we are better situated in our careers, my wife and I would like to adopt. Wish I could but cancer's a bee. I honestly don't want to, I'm not straight anyway, so it wouldn't be my biological kid. Not that I have an issue with adoption, but I'm not gonna be continuing my family either way. I am just not good with kids, either. I'll have kids but I need to be more financially situated before I can properly afford it. I'm really looking forward to them just have too much debt after school. Number. No. 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 Number. No thanks. But you're still young. You'll change your mind when you're older. No rush. Really looking forward to having a lil dude and teach him everything a young lil dude should know. No thank you, I'm content with my cats. Turning 20, and I love kids, I teach during the summers and babysit all the time. I'm good with kids and I enjoy taking care of them. That said, I never, ever, freaking want to have kids of my own. The responsibility of being the highest authority in, and primary insurer of the continuation of a child's life is terrifying. Shaping a person is a huge responsibility, and I would much, much rather my kids never exist than be unhappy mentally ill poorly adjusted for life because of my flawed parenting methods. Heck you can be the best parent in the world and crap still hit the fan with your kid. I don't have a quarter of a million dollars so no thanks. One word, nope. Nope, don't want them. Never having them, never been a huge fan. I want dogs, cats, and a 1970 Dodge Challenger. I don't plan on having any. I have so much I'd like to achieve in my lifetime. And I know that having kids would make some offset things hard to accomplish, or borderline impossible. Also, the world is at 7 billion people now. I've heard predictions that it will be 9 billion by 2050. I don't want to contribute to overpopulation destroying the planet. Finally, I have some health problems that I'd rather not get into. I'm not willing to pass them on. In this economy, PSSH. Frick that. Not happening. This place is fricked. Quite topical for me as a 27 year old guy, who's found out maybe 5 days ago, my best friend of 13 years is expecting his first child. I feel weird about it. Not that he wouldn't be a good father, 
he's in a good place in his life to have a family. I feel weird about the concept of having one myself. I'm engaged, but currently dealing with a few health issues that make being a functional human being something of a goal, not something I currently am. I couldn't imagine anything more fear and panic inducing than being one of two solely charged for the survival of a tiny being that literally has no capacity to look after itself. I guess technically I'm a millennial, but I was born in the 80s and I'm 30. I have one and another on the way. It sucks now financially, but I'm glad I did it now, versus 10 years from now. By the time my kids are in school, I'll be in my mid-30s and out from under the daycare costs. Life will be much easier. It's just a trade-off now. Once they graduate and leave, I'll still be young enough to have a little bit of my life back. I have an IUD to specifically prevent them from ever happening to me, and I plan on getting another, and another, and another until I'm old and dried up. I can barely take care of myself. I'm still a baby, and babies can't have babies. I'm a 25 year old baby. I'm super excited to have kids, I have to wait though because college and kids don't play well finically but I've always wanted to be a dad. I personally don't plan on having any, I like my time and the little bit of money I have. Here is my plan, buy out a few orphanage, then raise all of the children in it from a young age as diplomats and politicians, then send them out into the world, and control from behind the scenes. The children will always be loyal to father, you will see. Not gonna happen. Not having kids is like a cheat code, my long term GF and I are living together, I'm making 12 an hour and she's a school teacher, and we feel pretty well off, our peers are struggling with the same income with kids. It's a sad day when people with those income levels are the norm, I'll be the first one to say the majority of millennials are fricked even though I am one. You have been visited by the tourist dog comment photos everywhere to get an exciting trip full of adventures. If you are new to the channel, you can subscribe. I publish new videos every day. Until then, check another video. Or don't. Either way, have a great day you magnificent people.